Hello. Today I'm reading from the Constitution of the United States, Articles 5, 6, and 7. Article 5. The Congress, whenever two-thirds of both houses shall deem it necessary, shall propose amendments to this Constitution, or, on the application of the legislatures of two-thirds of the several states, shall call a convention for proposing amendments, which, in either case, shall be valid to all intents and purposes as part of this Constitution, when ratified by the legislatures of three-fourths of the several states, or by the convention in three-fourths thereof, or as one or the other mode of ratification may be proposed by the Congress, provided that no other amendment which may be made prior to the year 1808 shall in any way, manner, affect the first and fourth clauses to the ninth section of the first article, and that no state without its consent shall be deprived of its equal suffrage in the Senate. Article 6. All debts contracted and engagements entered into before the adoption of this Constitution shall be as valid against the United States under this Constitution as under the Confederation. This Constitution and the laws of the United States, which shall be made in pursuant, pursuance thereof, and all treaties made, or which shall be made under the authority of the United States, shall be the supreme law of the land, and the judges in every state shall be bound thereby. Anything in the Constitution or laws of any state to the contrary notwithstanding. The senators and representatives before mentioned, and the members of the several state legislatures, and all executive and judicial office officers, both of the United States and of the several states, shall be bound by oath or affirmation to support this Constitution, but no religious test shall ever be required as a qualification to any office or public trust under the United States. Article 7. The ratification of the conventions of nine states shall be sufficient for the establishment of this Constitution between the states so ratifying the same, done in the convention by the unanimous consent of the states present the 17th day of September, in the year of our Lord, 1787, and of independence of the United States of America, the twelfth in witness whereof we have hereunto subscribed our names. George Washington, President and Deputy from Virginia. And then each of the signers also scribe names.